how much fun snowmobiling is. And when you bring in a couple of hundred riders to join in on an opportunity to win some cold hard cash, along with over $25,000 in prizes, the fun factor gets even bigger. Now take that and add to it a special gourmet dinner and an evening concert that raises the roof off the joint. Now that's what we call a big deal. And it's exactly what went down in Sudbury, Ontario. The Big Deal Poker Run, promoted by Daco Belt, Snowgore Canada Magazine and Snowmobiler TV, was a poker run and a whole lot more. Partnering with the Sudbury Trail Plan and various others, a new event was born to offer great fun for snowmobilers and a great boost for the community. Last fall when we started to get this thing rolling, we got pretty excited here at Sudbury Trail Plan because it, that's what we felt we required here, was to get somebody to understand that we do have great trails. It's just an enjoyable family experience to go out and ride for the day and get a group together and enjoy a day on the trails and, and have a great dinner dance later. Sudbury has a great history of snowmobiling, snowmobiler events. Um, a citizenry that loves their machine, loves to get out on that fresh powder. So. When we saw this opportunity to engage with the Big Deal event and support that uh, market, we were instantly interested. I have a personal attachment. I'm a snowmobiler, but uh, aside from that, from a, from a media standpoint, a big event like that in Sudbury had been missing for a long time, and it, I saw it as an opportunity for us to get a hold of something that was new starting up, I thought could gain some legs and go year after year and, and get us in at the ground level. It was great, you know, the concept was perfect, you know, uh, to get the snowmobile community back into it again. The, the whole event, I think, took off really nice. Well, I think that, you know, you can develop festivals around special events and it was a really great start. Um, you know, we had a package that was set up through the city and so the hotels uh, benefit, the restaurants benefit. Spectators who, you know, have stayed away possibly from snowmobiling in the past can be enticed back into the sport. I was always part of the, uh, the runs that we did in the past here in Sudbury. It's been four or five years since anything's been really done. So I'd, uh, when it was approached us as, as far as promoting something and getting back out there with a run, everybody was willing to come on board and I wanted to be a part of that. Having had rain followed by a flash freeze, trail conditions were icy, but the riders came out understanding you can't control the weather and were prepared to scratch a bit and burn a little high facts before hitting the good snow and solid trails in the north end of the route. Each of the four checkpoints welcomed the riders to their establishments and hosted the volunteers who manned the game set up for the participants to select their cards. It made for some fun as the tension was building to see who would have top poker hand and collect the $1,000 cash top prize. It's awesome, it's good to get everybody together and it's nice to have something where you can do a poker run and stop at different places, warm up and you know, people know why you're there, so it's good. Oh, I think it's great, uh, it, like it brings the community together as well as brings uh, people from outside the community in to experience what Sudbury has to offer in general. Well, I think it's a good event. I think it should be an annual event for sure. For, uh, for 75 bucks, you get, uh, you get a, lot of, uh, a lot for your money. Adding to the excitement, a concert featuring country music recording artist Larry Berrio was what would keep the folks dancing all night long. Berrio is a local Sudburyan and longtime snowmobiler who was instrumental in making the big deal happen. I sent a, an email off to Snowmobiler TV and Snowgore Magazine with an idea, let's, uh, if it's possible, to get them up here to Sudbury and organize a poker run and an event and have some live entertainment and, um, you know, one thing led to another and here you guys are up at the, with Snowmobiler TV up in Sudbury, uh, you know, come up with the name The Big Deal, which uh, it sure was, it sure, uh, I, I'm so proud of it uh, that it turned out to become a really big deal. The event was phenomenal. It was a very long day and everybody from the start of the morning to the evening had the energy. We're energized to do the, the whole run. Uh, the weather wasn't 100% on our side, but uh, everybody came in with a smile on their face, wanting to enjoy the day, the atmosphere. Uh, compliments were given about how everything was run smoothly and right down to the dinner and entertainment in the evening. Plans are already in the works for the second annual Big Deal, so be sure to keep an eye out for dates to get it on your ride calendar.
STV is sponsored by Articat, celebrating 50 years in snowmobiling. By Ultimax Snowmobile Belts, make it a round trip. And by Snowboard Canada Magazine, Canada's best snowmobile. Next week on Snowmobiler TV, the crew offers up some first impressions on the new sleds. The cameras head to the track to capture the Rockstar CSRA Championship Finals, and we drop in on the Edmonton Snowmobile Show for some tire kicking. Got comments or suggestions? Email us at info at snowmobilertv.com. And be sure to visit the STV website for more awesome sledding videos and entertainment. We appreciate your time. Join us again for STV.